Hi Leo, welcome to your weekly reading. This is for April 24th through April 30th. I hope you have a great week. Let's get to your reading for the day. We'll pull an oracle card, we'll pull a few mythical goddess cards, and we'll see from there. My mythical goddess cards are in um, direct alignment with the Rider Wait tarot cards. They're just a little different. Um, the major arcanas are labeled differently, but it's okay. They talk to me. I study dreams and stuff, so ancient Egypt it is. And that would be why I bought the cards, because of Isis on the front. What it reminded me of. So I bought them. And you get to have your reading with them. Okay. Listen, quiet the mental chatter, receptivity, inner voice of guidance, overtone of the reading, okay? Inner voice of guidance. Get out into nature, Leo. Step outside your door. Take it in, because that's what this is telling me. Take in nature. All right, let's see your card. That's the undertone. If you're not able to get out in nature, let me know. Let me bring some nature inside. Turn the page. Move on from the past. Step into the unknown. Blessings await. Okay, Leo, turn the page. Whatever it is you're hanging on to, it's time to turn the page and move on. Okay, turn the page. It's a new beginning. Yes, it is. Step into the unknown. Blessings away. That's awesome, Leah. Truly, that's awesome. I'm stepping into the unknown myself. I am not Leo, though. I am Taurus, and I digress. All right, come on. Okay, Leo, what do you need for the week to get you through? Weekly reading for Leo. What does my Leo need to get through the week happy and healthy? Any challenges they might come into? Let's get a focus for Leo for the week. Keep them aligned with the divine, with the Mother Earth, nature, the one, God. Come on, let's get your reading, Leo. Yeah, I've got some Leo friends out there. They're a lot like me. Magically inclined. Um, living with the earth and listening to our spirit guides and striving to hit that astral realm, the astral realm, the ethereal realm. Yeah, we do. It's okay, Leo. It's okay. Let's go. Let's get back to your reading. There we go. One, two, Really? All together? And I pull four. Okay, fine. I don't know what's going on, Leo, but let's find out, okay? Ah. Wise woman, huh? Inner knowing. Knowledge. Yes, we know. All right. Come on. My goodness. Leo, 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 what more could you want? Seriously, turn the page, move on. Isolation. Oh yeah, get out of that isolation. You don't need to be there. Whatever it is you're going through, whether it's feelings or a real life 3D scenario, so to speak, no, the isolation fades. Open up your heart, okay? Turn the page, let go of the past. Let the divine in, look to the future. Because that's where we're going. We're not living in the past. Our past defines us. It makes us who we are. But we can change it. We can get in and we can intertwine the light and the dark. And, and tune to our higher self and listen. And that's 
what this is telling me, Leo, is it's time for you to turn the page, move past whatever happened, and, you know, get out of isolation. Come back. It's okay. Oh, failure. No. You know, try again. All right? Try again, Leo. Please. Try again. There is no such thing as failure. It's just a missed opportunity. All right? Try again. Oh, manifestation. See? No failure. Manifestation. It's time to turn the page and bring about what you want to happen. To manifest your dreams, your hopes, your desires. Whatever it is you're thinking of that you think you failed, turn the page try again you might be surprised okay this fourth card you know what pessimism all right we're gonna get you a fairy blessing today that's what we're gonna do we are going to increase your confidence i pray with a fairy blessing let's get the blessing from the fairies that my leos need okay I'm telling you, everything's coming to fruition. I promise, Leos. Whatever you've got going on, whether it's, you know, a trial at a job or a relationship or a past mistake that you just can't see your way past, the way through it, just turn the page. Write a new story. That, that chapter is gone. Start a new chapter. No reason for pessimism. You're glorious, Leo. Okay. Fairy blessings. Oh my goodness. Okay, Leo. From my fairies to you, Leo. They're actually all of our fairies. <laughs> okay. Let's get you that fairy blessing. Let's see. What blessing do my Leos need? For this week to carry them through keep them smiling attuned to the inner being the higher self right the divine that's what we want right leo we want to walk with the divine i know it's hard when you don't see the way clear when maybe you're homebound or you just can't get out like you used to it is hard to see that light, how something's going to manifest when you can't do things the way you used to. Whether it's physical, mental, or emotional limitations. Um, I promise you, turn the page. Come watch my videos, Leo. It's going to be okay. We're going we're gonna to make it. I promise you're going to do great. No need for pessimism. I have enough positivity for both of us, for all of us. Whoever, Leo, I'm talking to all right, let's get your fairy blessing. Oh, my. I'm always nervous. I never know what blessing is going to come through. They're always good, though. Fairies aren't going to hurt us. As long as you approach them gracefully with love. The gift of sharing. Seriously? That's... That's just tremendous. The gift of sharing. Sharing your knowledge, your emotions, your turmoils, your successes, your opportunities for success that you missed. Sometimes known as failures. Sometimes. I just don't like the negative connotation of the word. That's all, Leo. I don't like it. But the gift of sharing, share yourself. Please, Leo, share yourself with the world. You're glorious. You have so much love inside of you. You are so divine. And you have so many gifts. So many. You are so in tune with nature. I know you are. I can tell. When I look at this in the wonderment coming up from the water, to share a fish with a fairy that's on the outside. To share from what she knows, right? She, she takes what she knows, what she has, her blessings, her gifts, and she gives them out 
to somebody else. Sharing. Try it, Leos. Try sharing your life this week. Try sharing just a little piece of yourself to somebody else. I promise it'll work out better than you think. You have the fairies behind you. All right. Let's go ahead and get your healing energy for the week. If you're watching my videos, you know we're all about healing, right? Finding ways to overcome the obstacles in our life in a positive manner as we draw closer to the divine, to the source, to the light, to my fairies, to the ethereal realm. That's what it's all about. It's about you know, living the best we can because we want to. We want to make a change in this world. We do. We want the collective consciousness of the divine, of the entire universe. We just want to raise that vibration so high that all the bad just goes away. I know. I'm a bit silly sometimes. I've been doing shadow work this week. You have to excuse me. Readings will be back a little bit more normal next week, maybe. Maybe I won't be so mushy. My apologies, Leos. Okay, let's get your card. It's going to be a great week, Leo. Just take the courage. Take heart, okay? Turn the page. Move from the past. And let's move forward and see where we end up. You're going to be okay, Leos. I promise. All right? One more. Freedom. Yeah, but you know. It just popped out. Okay, here we go. If it comes again, that will now. I tease. Come on. Freedom. Overtone of the day. That's what all this brings when you turn the page. When you accept that it wasn't a failure. When you accept that it's all okay. Let go of the, the pessimism. Let go of it. Manifest what you want. Speak it into existence. Live it. Be it. You'll do it. It's perfect, Leos, okay? All right. Let's get on with our healing energy. Release. Well, that seems real appropriate. Without looking at the card when I hear release, I am... Thinking that I need to tell you to release your anger, release the frustration, release the sadness, release the tears, release the criticism from the inside, release the pessimism, let it go. You're divine, Leos, I promise, let it go. But hey, maybe we should read the card, what do you say? Let's read it. Release. I stop fighting my fears and the hardships of life. I control my thoughts, live in the present moment, and accept each stage of life. I work on what I have power over and put it into God's hands, what I can't change. I trust that everything will work out for the best. Now, for those of you who don't subscribe to God or creation, Jesus, that doesn't matter. You have a God doesn't matter if it's nature, the earth, the moon, the stars, whatever your higher self says that's what you believe in, that's it. That becomes your God. So careful what you believe in, Leos, okay? That's what I'm going to say. Careful what you believe in because your beliefs truly do direct you to your end life purpose, right? So just be really careful, Leo. That's all I'm going to say. Love and light. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.